I'm of the opinion that this was orchestrated either from the White House um, or by uh, possibly uh, someone um, associated with the White House. If you look at the statement made um, by the President on March 15th, he made the statement that uh, they would be submitting evidence to the committee soon. Um, that suggests to me that, in fact, this has all been orchestrated. This is a three-act play. He did not, he just apologized. He didn't specify what his apology was about. Um, he, he knows full well that there is grave question about his objectivity. And I think over the next few days, we're going to assess um, whether or not we feel confident that he can continue in that role. We'll look at the information that we receive tomorrow and then based on that we can assess whether or not this was appropriate to hold a press conference on, to go to the White House. I think this is all part of the President's inability to say I was wrong, it was false what I said, and I apologize. He owes President Obama an apology and frankly the American people because we have spent way too much time on this ridiculous idea that he was being um, surveilled by President Obama. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.